Hello, this is my silicone mask review of a customized CFX Horseman of Famine. It was painted by Joe D. Evans off Facebook, and I had it painted up as a poison dart frog. He added spots. I have a gloss finish done to it. He repainted the gums, the tongue, pretty much the whole mask to give it a completely different look. The mask itself is made by CFX, and it's a good fitting mask. I have a 23 inch head and it fits me pretty well. It's slightly tight, which is okay. The eye holes line up really nice on it. It's a great overall mask. The tongue is all out of silicone. Teeth, everything is all silicone on the mask. Let me give it a spin so you can take a look at it. The new paint job gave it a completely different look. I like it a lot better painted like this. I originally bought the mask from CFX painted up in their tan version. And uh, I just got kind of tired of it. And so Joe does repaints. And I talked with him and he thought it would be a good idea to get it painted as a poisoned art frog because dealing with the tongue. And the finish that he did on it is a gloss finish to replicate a amphibian that their skin is wet all the time instead of matting it down like most silicone masks are. These retail, I think, somewhere for around $600 from CFX. Okay, let me get the camera in for some close viewing. There's the teeth, tongue. That's what the head looks like. Let's get underneath that tongue. So people can see. When you wear this mask, your mouth actually comes out. Let me see if I can make it where you can see it. It's actually in here in the mask. So if you're ever wondering where your mouth is in this mask, it's actually above the tongue. But it's a great overall mask. Uh, I believe CFX will paint it how you want it, but they offer, I think, a tan version, and they offer a clown version, which looks really nice. I just thought I would come up with my own design. Okay, let me set this sucker back down. Turn on the side again so you can see it. This mask has a lot of movement when you wear it. It's kind of a heavy mask a little bit. It's very easy to put on. No kind of issues putting it on. Got your old ear holes. Eyes line up very nice. Contact CFX on the interweb or you can get on Facebook and look up CFX or composite effects and they can get you one of these masks and then you can contact Joe D. Evans if you're interested in getting a repaint that CFX will not do and he can get you fixed up. Well there is my silicone mask review of the CFX Horseman of Famine. Thanks for watching.